Hey folks, hope everybody's doing good today. Hope uh, hope everybody's having a warm and blessed day. I just wanted to make a video real quick. Got up this morning, had some had some new information there waiting on me, and uh, but we ended up getting we, like every Sunday. Got up, got ready, we went to church and uh, had a great sermon from Pastor Chris Hodges at Church of the Highlands. Y'all check him out online. He is amazing. I love him. Uh, but anyways, I wanted to reach out. I wanted to make a video about what I've kind of figured out and uh, what new information. Y'all probably seen it all over Facebook. I've not been able to uh, post anything because I have been blocked from Facebook. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to continue to make a video when I learn something new or or my two cents or whatever and i'll post it to my youtube channel and and just ask uh ask that some of y'all share it for me since i can't get on facebook anymore so never been banned from facebook had it for lord knows umpteen years and i start talking politics and i get banned awfully ironic ain't it but anyways uh i just want to say that i have got the information that the Pope was arrested <coughs> uh, over I think it was 60 or 80 counts of child porn trafficking you know I hope they burn every one under the ground in my opinion you touch a kid you deserve to be tortured for the rest of your life and it shouldn't be too awful long but that's just that that to me is the most sickening thing that could happen on this planet is, is people touching kids Every one of them ought to be hung from daggum power lines or telephone poles or courthouse square or whatever. Make an example that this country won't stand for that nasty, freaking satanic, just evil crap. It's disgusting. <coughs> and if you're thinking about doing it, just go ahead and tie your belt around your neck. Do the world a favor. Ruining some innocent kid's life. Gosh, ah, it pisses me off. But anyway, thankfully they got him. I hope they bring the whole freaking world ring down on that mess. But what really concerns me is Pakistan uh, going to a total blackout last night. So, um, you know, everybody's... <coughs> everybody I'm talked to, everybody that, um, that knows more than I do about this is saying, get ready. Stock up on your groceries for two weeks. Make sure you got plenty of batteries. Make sure you got plenty of uh, freedom seeds, you know, them things that that come out of something else really, really fast. Make sure you got plenty of them. And uh, and just be ready. I mean, be ready to protect your family. Be ready to protect your neighbor. Uh, and I hope, uh, I hope we all make it. I hope everything turns out okay. One thing about it, God is in control. <clears throat> And uh, I find my peace in that. I really do. So, uh, yeah, just, just get stocked up on groceries, folks. Batteries, water, canned foods. Uh, if you've got a generator, make sure it's gassed up. Make sure it's got diesel in it. Make sure it's, it's ready to go. Just, just get yourself prepared. I mean, think for the things that you wouldn't think of, you know. Sit there and go through a, a mental checklist. Think of the things like, you know, what am I forgetting? What am I missing? What, what is something that I wouldn't normally think of right here? Uh, and just, just, just get ready. I mean, I just watched a video on a uh, pastor who's got some pretty good intel from up in DC, and they're talking about, uh, you know, it could last up to 30 days. This martial law, if they declare martial law, you know, here's the thing is the social media outlets they're already trying to dictate what we can and can't do um and and so who's to say that the power companies ain't just gonna say to heck with it and shut everything down you know so flashlights batteries canned food water um generators i mean just everything you can you can do to be ready and uh and put your faith in God. That's all we can do. That is all we can do. So, just want y'all to know again, listen, I've got so many daggum comments, so many daggum uh, messages. Um, I'm able to read them. Can't respond to most of them. But 
thank y'all from the bottom of my heart. Thank y'all for the support. And uh, just know that I'm not ignoring y'all. I've just, I'm blocked. So there's that. So again, if somebody would share this video from YouTube onto Facebook so that people can hear what I have found out, which probably ain't no news to very many people. I mean, I don't know, it may be. If it reaches one person that didn't know, that didn't know it, it's worth it. So y'all just be safe out there. Don't go freaking out buying up all the gosh dang toilet paper again. <laughs> oh man. Y'all just be careful, be safe. I love each and every one of y'all. And uh, God bless you. God bless America.